for you to be saying Toko Shingalia all day. That's well, that's the only reason I came to work. It sounds like <laughs> Coco Chanel, though. It sounds like they traded. I, was get to, I knew I was going to get to say it. Toko Shingala, not to be confused with Darius Songaila. Correct, the and former that's, bull. Yeah, and, and it's see so you. You would. Do you hear the phone ringing? By the way, no. Okay, because a bad call is calling the phone in here, and he's laughing. <laughs> Why is he just to make it ring? Yeah, because he's because I can hear it. He knows right. I can hear it, and he's trying to distract me. Oh, now I hear it. Wow. See, and then he's... Oh, there it is. Oh, there it is. I hear it. He's a jerk, isn't he? So were you almost saying Sungaila? Because I thought it was Sungaila no, I mean, when well, I first saw it. Uh, well, no. Oh. But it, but it does kind of... It seeps in there, you know, into oh. the brain. After an entire day, it would. Right. Well, I mean, actually, you, when I... Uh, why is everybody messing with you? And now they're printing stuff. Oh. <laughs> They're printing stuff. They are calling me. Because they miss him. They Maddie's don't see him enough. Maddie's going to be there setting up a crock pot next. <laughs> it's already wor- it's already running. It's Italian beef in it. Why? It's got to be Italian just because Maddie did it. Huh? Why? He's, he can only make Italian food? Racist. Right? He couldn't... He couldn't ex- oh, okay. Yeah. Well, I mean, come on. Right. No, because I, actually, isn't it Matt I've heard that makes good Italian beef? Isn't it him? Yeah, it's him. He has to, just like I make the great matzo ball soup. Now, now you're racist. Yeah, Tanny just boils everything. <laughs> <laughs> well, he's in West Virginia. <laughs> what does Joe do? I don't even know what Dredge's ethnicity I don't, I don't, what is. is I think he's from another planet. I, boils his pants. <laughs> Have you seen? <laughs> All right, whatever Joe does, it involves pants. an incident with his pants. <laughs> Have you seen his sweatshirt that has a, a giant hole in the elbow? No. He wore it. He wore it. Uh, was it Thursday? Whatever day it was, I was here last. He wore yeah. it. It's it's got a, uh, it's a, it's a navy blue, right? Navy blue or dark green? It's something like that. It's got this giant hole <laughs> right in the elbow. And see, <laughs> the thing about Dredge, Dredge is a man of mystery, and we he don't is. need to go to to his his ethnic background or anything like that because he's just so Dredge that you automatically have. Things to make fun of without having to say, "Oh yeah, well you're Italian or you're Greek or German or Jewish," because he's just dredge. Well, I just asked him what he is, his ethnic background, yeah. mm-hmm. and he looked at me and said, "White." <laughs> I, it's probably he's probably from the Caucasus, actually. <laughs> <laughs> he's probably a Chechen separatist. I, we, no one has any idea. I mean, if, if, you, if you just if did like a Google search for the last White. name Dredge, we would say, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> He's the kind of guy that has stains on everything, you know? <laughs> or, 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 or will What's soon. What's your ethnicity? White. Well, that's he's, he's probably not lying. Joe would buy a new suit and immediately get a stain on it. <laughs> they got a humdinger of a suit there. It's uh, different. <laughs> Deadline for Japanese pitching prospect Masahiro Tanaka is Friday. Also the- white. That's not true. Oh, right. He's Japanese. Correct. Uh, the Yes Network says that he's going to pick between the Cubs and Yankees, narrowed it down to that. Mm-hmm. In the NFL, Paul Pascaloni sets to take over one of the Bears' defensive coaching openings. Both line and linebacker positions are open. And the United States has offered to send military assets. No, they offered to send Joe Dredge, actually. <laughs> What was that? What? what? <laughs> Something happened over there that was probably bad. <laughs> what did you just do, Matt? <laughs> okay. So you they... got to show him that. Show him that so I don't look like a psycho. I'll go, I'll go over here. Wanna... <laughs> the only one this happens to. The only one. <laughs> look at that. I don't know if I could say that. <laughs> what the hell's going on out here? <laughs> that's that's perfect for Ron G too. <laughs> that couldn't be better. <laughs> they're all trying to get my attention, and they're like, "Look, look, look." <laughs> We're the worst. <laughs> we really are. I, it just, it's just always raunchy. Can you say, can, can you say that? <clears throat> yeah. Why not? <laughs> All right. Well, then you say it because I'm not. You you just you just tell everybody what they did. I don't think it'll be as funny. <laughs> I, th- I think it's better if we keep it to ourselves. <laughs> well, you know the the actor Andrew Koenig. 
He was on Growing Pains. <laughs> okay. Remember that TV show? I. Uh, uh, it's a flicker. Yeah. Is that the one with that where Alan Thick sang the theme song? Yeah, right. That's okay. the the what's it? Kirk Cameron. Yes. Is that right? Growing Pains. Kirk Cameron. Yeah. Pains. So his his best friend on the show, the actor Andrew Koenig, his character name was Boner. Okay. Like Merkel's boner. Right. And then there's a story of the New York Post that we just alerted Ronji to. Where the, the headline is, in qu- it's <laughs> Boner found dead in Canada. <laughs> Wait, it just doesn't take much, does it? He's gone. <laughs> wow. Uh, Why Bob likes him. Here, let me tell you the thing about... Uh, hold on. Oh, his dad is Walter Koenig. Oh. Chekhov from Star Trek. Really? Yeah. They said, I guess he killed himself. Well, also, that's a happy ending to this whole little bit of radio comedy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's just well, nice. <laughs> I mean, that headline got me. You know, when they were making that character up, though, and his full name on the show was Richard Boner Stabone? <laughs> Come on. No. No, you named him Boner first, and then you invented a last name so you well, could call him Boner. Name. Right. Richard Boner Stabone. He gone. All right. Um, <clears throat> what are we doing? At the no, let, let, me, let me do this little... Uh, we're, we're still in the update. Yeah, let me, let me tell you the thing well, about right. this. That's right, we are. Right. We're in the real update. quick, real quick. Radio. Right. You manage your game console, your fitness plan, and a startup. Now you can file your federal taxes with TaxAct.com. You got this. TaxAct.com. Easy, fast, and all e-fileable federal forms are free. TaxAct.com. I'm not even going to do the lockout. Super Bowl 48 is on the uh, 2nd of February, starts at 3 on the score. Who's playing in that game? Doesn't matter. <laughs> How's Toko Sengalia doing? It's, no, it's, it's, it's Shengalia. 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 <sighs> and he's a bull. Ron G's here, isn't it? Goodbye. It's special man. Thank you. <laughs> Well, say your Maybe a world words. record there. Yeah, and show business in a moment. What are you waving at me, Tannehill? Oh, this hour is brought to you by Sunrise Chevrolet. Big nope. inventory, big deals. SunriseChevrolet.com.